A deeply troubling development in the recent death of an iconic Texas lawmaker. Fox 26 political reporter Greg Grugan here to tell us why the family of former Congresswoman Eddie Bernice Johnson is suing a well-known hospital system. Greg. Yeah, Caroline and Rashi, the simple answer is negligence. According to the former Congresswoman's family and attorneys, the legislative icon was discovered lying in her own feces and urine while recovering from back surgery at the Baylor Scott and White Health System. Now, attorneys for the former congresswoman's son say the lack of fundamental care at Baylor Scott and White triggered an infection of Johnson's surgical wound last October, resulting in the rapid deterioration of her health. The 15-term congressman was moved to her home with hospice care on December 19th and passed away on New Year's Eve. She was 88 years old. At a press conference announcing the litigation, lawyers for Johnson's family said laboratory reports confirm excrement was the source of the former congresswoman's ultimately fatal infection. Johnson's son calls the inept care his mother received inexcusable. Deplorable. She was being unattended to. She was screaming out in pain and for help. All of the evidence is that uh, the infection she got was from the feces. If she had gotten proper care at that facility, she would be here today. Ironically, Eddie Bernice Johnson was the first registered nurse ever elected to the U.S. Congress. In a brief statement, Baylor Scott and White said they were committed to working with Johnson's family and legal counsel. The former Congresswoman's Memorial Service in Dallas is slated for Monday. In the newsroom, Greg Grugan, Fox 26 News.